Okay, so I got this question from a student, and I think this comes from her adaptive follow-up, so maybe not everybody has the question. But it's a good question to practice conversions, and that's really all it is. I'm going to actually go further and say it's ratios. This is a fractions question. All right, so let me start out by making some notes of the kinds of ways that I would read this question. In Europe, gasoline efficiency, oops, there's a term I'm not used to, so I'm just going to say EFF, making something up is measured in kilometers per liter. I think that's a throwaway. That's a waste, I think. But let's move on. If your car's gas mileage is 23 miles per gallon, that's what my, oh, okay, now I'm getting it. My mileage is another kind of efficiency. All right, so it looks like the efficiency of my car is 23 miles per gallon. Okay, so I'm going to say EFF of mine is 23 miles per gallon. How many liters of gasoline would it, you need to buy to complete a 125, I'm sorry, 142 kilometer trip in your car? So distance is equal to 142 kilometers using the following conversion. All right, so, so far I'm not really understanding much. I'm just making notes. One kilometer, 6.214 miles, and one gallon, Hope you guys don't mind the green. Hope you can see everything okay. 3.78 liters. All right, now I'm ready just to ask the question. Uh, <clears throat> let's go with black. <clears throat> uh, express your answer numerically in liters. So the question is, what is the question? How many liters? All right, so liters is my question. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to say liters must be in my solution somewhere. So I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to look for liters. Aha. Here's liters. Liters are related to gallons. So I'm taking care of that one. Now, and I didn't use this one because there's no numbers in it, right? That's just a unit. So um, now over here, we're going to have to cancel out gallons somewhere. So I'm looking here. Aha, I see it right here. Here's gallons. And what's gallons related to there? Miles. Now we've got to come and find miles. Ah, there it is. There. Boom, miles. What are miles related to? Uh, kilometers. Okay. And then I've got only one more number, and it's kilometers, which is perfect because kilometers are going to cancel out. And that's going to, everything's going to cancel. It's going to leave me with liters. Let me go back to green. One student asked me yesterday, can you, can you show how these things cancel? Bam, bam. You see that? Watch that. Bam, bam and liters, which is exactly what I wanted. Okay, now let's put the numbers in, calculate the question, and uh, I didn't even bring my calculator with me. All right, so let's let's try this. How many, what, what number goes with kilometers? Well, that came from right here. This is gonna be 142. What number goes with miles and kilometers? That's from right here. So it looks like it's 0 0.6214 and one kilometer. What numbers go here? Gallons and miles. It looks like it's one gallon per 23.0 miles. That's right here. And then what numbers go here? That looks like it's one gallon and 3.78 liters. All right, so, <clears throat> so that's gonna be our answer. I'm gonna step away from the camera for just a second here, see if I have my calculator. did not bring my calculator with me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this with my my phone, which is too slow and too long. This is 142 times 0.6214 times 3.78 divided by 23 equals, where am I here, equals 14.50185 and so on, okay? So let's do the sig figs now. I'm going to go back to green. This has three sig figs in it. 
This has four sig figs in it. This has an infinite number of sig figs because it's just a because it's a a one. It's a definition. That's a definition. This has three sig figs in it. This has three sig figs in it. So the answer is going to have how many sig figs in it? Three. Okay, so it looks like the answer is going to be, let's go back to black. This is about the same thing as 14.5 liters, and that's the answer. Okay, hope that's helpful.